Welcome to the licensing session. I'm Kyle Courtney, and this is Building LLTDM. Let's identify a use case for you to keep in mind as you're moving through uh, the licensing lectures. Let's say a TDM scholar has a new critical interdisciplinary research project on women's roles in top 50 corporations in the United States from 1920 through 2020. For their analysis, they want to create a data file that includes both the text and basic metadata for selected articles focusing on women's roles from key national newspapers, which also includes coding work developed for the project to text mine and index all that information. The scholar believes that the unique data set they will create via the TDM process, which includes both the metadata and full text of the articles, would be incredibly useful to other researchers studying this same interdisciplinary topic. Because of the scope and the range of the timeline, the 1920s through 2020, some of these articles are in the public domain and some are in copyright. For those that are in copyright, the TDM scholar can access and hopefully mine some of these articles through the university library's licensed resource. This is a database uh, which is commonly sold to higher education markets by a vendor that has a relationship with major newspapers and collects indexes and provides full access to these newspapers that are generally historical in nature. However, some of the articles will be accessed and mined via a subscription agreement. The TDM Scholar has an online subscription to this particular newspaper and receives daily emails featuring the day's articles. Additionally, one national paper in particular that was the subject of some of the scholar's research provides access to the historical newspaper via a separate agreement, which is not part of the daily circulation agreement. The scholar wants to mine these newspapers, develop the coding, and publish this data set with the selected articles in full text and make it a public use file. The scholar plans, once the TDM process is over, to select articles for the data set that are decidedly small and selected portions of all the newspaper and vendors' total licensed databases. And arguably, this would not substitute for a full subscription to any of the newspaper or databases. These articles serve as a critical base for the project and are a key component in its future value in related research. So this might be a very familiar scenario. As we will review, license or contracts is an agreement between two parties to specific terms. They can modify, change, or alter rights. And the licensing of digital content exists in a, a legal realm that is separate from copyright law. However, they do interact, as they most likely will in this scenario, or any TDM scenario, really. Now, please take a moment to reflect on this scenario. What issues do you see arising? What are some of the factors identified that will benefit this work? How might this require more explanation, negotiation? How would you begin to strategize and understanding any risk on the use, input, and output of the data and full text.